shut up. Oh! You enslaved us for years. Oh! Told us your stories about what you do told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. I need that shit out the kindness of my heart. Do you, do you nigga want to be scared of me? Not this way. What the fuck? I was going here. If y'all coming from the last episode or whatever, you know what to do. Like the video, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucker. Ooh. Like the video, like the video, like the video. Am I okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble. No, uh, he didn't make it easy. Crooked man's place. No, uh, he didn't make it easy. Yeah. What happened? A lot. It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. Yeah. We can talk about it later. You yeah. did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know... I ain't killed a nigga. I'm just glad you made it back in one piece. Yeah, yo, yeah, yo. Time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes. What are you waiting for? You killed Lily. She was my sister. How could what you? do you have to yeah, say? Yeah. Where the yourself? fuck do you get off? You think you have the right and to just do this to people? You're a fucking crook. This. I'm gonna let them. Shit hole. Everyone, <laughs> can I have your attention? Crooked man, more like crooked nose. <laughs> short notice. I know normally we'd schedule Look at this hearing, hit. but <laughs> considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. Nigga know like a cute angle. The crooked man is charged with the murder as of I Faith and- As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White, but I thought it would be unwise to proceed with such faulty information. You get Georgie may have killed them. But you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? Yeah, Sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel now? Is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. Well, where is he? Sheriff? Georgie was a victim of this psycho too. He was pushed into the whole thing and uh -huh. now he's dead. He's what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. No, 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 no. Doesn't change anything. We'll deal with I had to get away from it. I killed him. I had to. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I was I don't... told I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? If you'd wait a moment. I'm well aware of my rights, Miss White. Unless you plan to abandon the charter in time. No, let her finish. Let her finish. Yeah. Have your say. Yeah. If you insist. Yeah. <clears throat> That's off that clear throat. <laughs> murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, uh -huh. inciting violence against various members of the Fable Town community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Damn right. Damn right. Aiding and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud. I hope y'all got y'all snacks. Give me a minute. I know this might be a little annoying, but I know y'all that want to hear me open this damn rice. This is rice crispy in y'all damn ears. So give me a little minute. Thank you. Fraud, extortion, racketeering, oh. and the illegal possession and sale of magical art. Oh, it's rough. Uh -uh. Now, is there anything you would like to say? Speak. First of all, uh -huh. I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily, so you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Like hell, oh. stop the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. And there's all the other crap he's done. We all know <laughs> who you are. We know what you've done. Just give it up, oh. boy. The crooked man has committed crimes against this government and, most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if Don't let them cook. are enough to justify death. Upon which your body will be committed to the witching where house. it fucking belongs. That's so right. let's get but on with it. But we promised you a chance to defend yourself, and I won't rob you of that right. What the You're fuck? Really this is about what the fuck? If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap. One thing. No more secrets. Bluebeard, be been real quiet. Even when they don't deserve it. We had a single thing with him. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Speak, motherfucker. You want to talk? Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. 
I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. Uh -huh. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. Mm. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you gonna get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. Okay. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand. The butcher been real quiet too. Faithful employees. Okay. I had nothing to do with Tell it. This is such bullshit. For once. You've always been a bit of a powder keg. That's not what Georgie George seemed pretty convinced he didn't have a say in the matter. Uh -huh. He clearly misunderstood my intention. Really? I would uh -huh. never authorize such an act. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? I was yeah, your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me. As I protected them. Uh -huh. You understand wanting to protect what you care about, don't you? You'd do anything. You might even give up an innocent man. Just to save someone. What's he talking about? Yeah, right. They don't do it because they want to protect yeah, you. Yeah, they scare you. You intimidate ass. people. You scare yeah. tanks. They're afraid if they don't follow orders, they'll end up dead. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that. Hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. What about Lily? No, you got hierarchies. She wasn't given a choice. Damn. Do you really think she wanted that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distaste for Bro, you know what I just remembered? I just remembered something, bro. I was like, who could have been there? Bro, Tweedledee or whoever the hell left, that nigga ain't dead. I hit him on the side of the head, but we found out multiple times during this gameplay, this series right here, this playlist series right here, we found out these niggas is durable as hell. If you ain't kill their ass, and you ain't see them visually die, them niggas ain't dead. So two things, Bloody Mary might still be alive, because that was just a glass breaking. I don't know what the fuck that means. Is she dead or not? I don't know. Two, we also have Tweedledee or Tweedledum from, the, uh, from that little place. So... We gotta think about that too. We gotta think about that too. Because just cause we knocked that nigga on the head, that nigga was not dead. Okay, same thing with the uh with the uh with the demon. So it's like three people. It's like three people that could be fucked like 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 be ready. You feel me? Be ready. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah. That's what you did to us. How uh -huh. you kept us all you in You forget line. it was not me who put you in that position. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. When your government abandoned you, left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners, I was there to look out for you. Yes, but... Wasn't I? We didn't abandon anybody. That was crazy. Don't turn this You're on the us. fucking problem here. Yeah, yeah, don't turn this bullshit on us. What about Auntie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands everything that matters anyway uh-huh nowhere else to turn she came to me for help and what did i do for you you got my tree back i got her tree back and in turn we used her magic to help poor fables get glamours because i helped her she was able to make a living provide for herself and what did they do for the longest time not much but they asked me to come work for them. Really? The new deputy mayor wants you on the 13th floor? No. The wolf offered me the job. She wanted my tree destroyed. If she had had her way, I'd be hung out to dry on a clothesline by now. What? This nigga gonna try to... I'm sorry for the pauses, but I think I see what he gonna try to do. He gonna try to paint me out to be just like him. Oh my fucking shit. Oh my lord have mercy. You were gonna burn her tree? Snow. Snow is Why the blame. Why would you want that? Is that true? Snow? Don't blame Snow. She had her reasons. Greenleaf was using Dang. her magic to help Crane and the Crooked Man. That's why Snow wanted your Dang. tree. That's not why. 
It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being Ooh. too soft to notice what he'd do to get it. Damn! It nothing to do with a crooked man. We've made some mistakes. <laughs> I. She walked up there so fucking loud. Believe me, I truly want what's best for this town. Like a true husband. That may not always be clear right away, but I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. Ah. Uh. And so does the sheriff. Right, one on Willie. Yeah, right. I can't promise you perfection. No one can. But I can promise to always have your best interests at heart. Like you did with her? Maybe you haven't noticed, but we've been doing all this to protect you. Right. We're trying to stop people like him. Right. The crooked man's been exploiting you. Exploiting your hope for a better life. Right. Go to him for help. And he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. I'm about to use. He exactly never cared about any way, of you. Someone would die. Do you really think the crooked man cared about you? He just cared about your money. He cares about your obedience. I was about to say that Faith and Lily went, but nah, that could have been used again. It. They're right. Oh. You're all still afraid of him. Oh. Now. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over. Uh, girls will have their justice. Okay, auntie. Now, now get your ass in that wheel. Very good. Very yeah, good. Good manipulator. I surely appreciate it, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence linking me to the. Georgie murder. was working for you. Bigby got a confession. A confession that, that nobody heard. Now I heard it. No I heard it. But I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke, especially given Bigby's history. Somebody what are you was there. About? Snow. You can't talk your way out of this. What about? And what about your history? Yeah. What about All your you've history, done to this buddy? Fucking town. What do you mean? There's no evidence. Maybe. Maybe he's. I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. I just Of need... course it's right. This man tormented all of you, for profit. Georgie Let killed him. Let me just him. make sure I understand you. Yeah. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did. Uh -huh. He was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course. Yes, you yes. are responsible, You're yes, nigga. responsible. Well, by that logic, Miss White should be on trial for Tweedledum's murder. Since you know Bigby works for her. That's... He killed a man. Now don't make him a murderer. Doesn't it? That was justified. For fuck's sake, killing someone who's trying to kill you is hardly... They were there to retrieve Crane. You didn't need to escalate things. Me? It was them. And who sent those two freaks anyway? Bigby and I have already discussed his being. I'm, I'm, hey. We're handling it internally. Now where have I heard that before? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch? Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? You can't be serious. That was different. What? You think you shouldn't be held accountable? He was a suspect, and I needed answers. Besides, right. I need some damn answers. Was still deputy mayor when that happened. Ah. Uh. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. For his own protection. Oh, you're right. If y'all letting this nigga manipulate y'all, what the I'm fuck? To tell the difference. That's enough. So you won't answer for your employees' behavior, but I must perish for this. This is completely different. I we did all... not order those two girls dead. It simply never. Where happened. is that gay buff she nigga? Killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. Isn't right. Oh please! This isn't the point. That's we'll deal with true. them after we deal with you. Listen, I'm That's not true. I need a true. certain level of privilege should be afforded to three. To who? This is how it's always been. Yes. See, this is exactly to what I'm speaking. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world. And ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with I thought I was saying that's not true to him. Who was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you? Treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny. Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? They're gonna Who will 
dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? The big Who bad will wolf. be the- Bigby! Miss White! What's my happen? Excuse me, I... dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath, little What's she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. You need Bluebeard. What? Go ahead. Uh, of course. Go right ahead. Go ahead. What you gotta say? You probably don't remember me. Go ahead. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. My dear, I don't Just know shut up. Oh! You enslaved us for years. Oh! Told us your stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <laughs> But you know what? Oh, Lord. Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Because she did. Did you kill her? Did he? Oh, yeah, he did. This is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. Her own life. Ah. Oh. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I Nerissa. My name is oh. Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. I wanted to say he might as well he have. ordered them dead. This fucker. Damn. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And now I can finally say. Damn. Suck so, so your shit. Ooh. And I hope you rot at the bottom of the witching well for what you did. Well, this confirms this it. This just confirms it. Boo. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. <laughs> oh! You're going to take the word of a what? A whore? At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Damn! Did you now? That boy swear, eh? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty! Good enough for me? Yeah. Too. Yeah, get your ass in that so way, I think. That's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves! You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know Damn. I won't let you go free after this. Wait! You're done talking, crooked man. You had your chance. Yeah, you had your chance, buddy. Well done, then. Now, you had your chance, sense. buddy. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I not good you. enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't hasn't stopped. Been enough I don't care. So, so we get rid of him. We get him out of here. We can Damn. Send everyone, away. listen up. Damn. I can't keep up what they're saying. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So okay. I think this we... is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. Why not? What about a vote? What do you think this is? Everyone, come All right, fuck down. it. We should vote. Should fuck it. Vote. Fuck it. Democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? Fuck it. He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Big B? What uh, about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. Damn. That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are Damn. You sure? This isn't how it's. It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay, Mr. Wolf. It's your call. I don't want that nigga dead. Fuck so, it. Just. Do what you think is right. Do what I think is right. Bye, nigga. Bye, nigga. Yes, Sheriff. Lock him up. Rip his head off. Throw him right. out the way. Teach him a fucking lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. Just fucking get rid of him. Not this way. Uh, what the fuck? I was gonna hit X. Your bitch ass off me. Man, fuck you, nigga. There you are. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. Finish it, Sheriff. Please, we can still- End it already. You know, just between us, I was gonna let you live. But now, 
You're going to miss me. Emma. No, I won't. Yes! Oh, I'm on demon time! Oh my god. Oh. Yes, sir. Bye bye. It's the same thing! What's the difference? Snow will remember that. It's the same fucking thing! For Lily and Faith. Yes. That shit said they're scared of me! Of us to erase from the books. Fuck it. Be scared shit. I did that shit out the kindness of my heart. These, these niggas wanna be scared of me? I know you lying. I know you fucking lying, boy. <laughs> 